Previously on the Real Home Base Package, I hopped in the crowd to experience Brazil's greatest love at the Maracanã. I sampled Rio de Janeiro's finest cuisine, checked out the beautiful Copacabana beachfront, and then joined the locals for a drink or two. Or four. Or six. The suckers. The suckers. So next year, when you'll book the real home base package, you'll begin to experience every last second of the marvelous city before match day when you travel to any city in Brazil to see the Socceroos play. Getting best of both worlds. The best city in Brazil. And all the soccer is action. So after the last few days enjoying Rio, the marvelous city, we're heading off to Brasilia to see the soccer is play Brazil. Next year, you'll be doing the exact same thing, whatever the city. How good is this? This time next year, on the Rio Home Base package, you and hundreds of other Australians will be packing out a flight, taking it over in green and gold, and chanting all the way up into the skies to whichever game the soccer are playing. And with the Green and Gold Army taking care of all ground transfers wherever you fly in and out of on match day, you'll have more time to experience the sights and festivities of the city hosting the Socceroos fixture. Imagine next year, days and nights after partying in Rio, you and hundreds of other Aussies, shoulder to shoulder and perhaps a little hungover, descend on whichever Brazilian city hosts the Socceroos match. Painting it green and gold. For me, the Socceroos match took me to Brasilia, the capital in the middle of the country. But whichever of the 12 host cities you fly out to on match day, you can be assured the Green and Gold Army Rio Home Base package will have you delivered safely, on time, and as pumped for kickoff as I was. And every single city in Brazil has, some, has something special, so. Not only that, but on match day, the Green and Gold Army will be throwing exclusive pre-match functions where over 500 Socceroos fans will amass for lunch or dinner. An expert panel will preview the upcoming match and, most importantly, the bar will be on the Green and Gold Army for a couple of hours before the game. What a better way to build up the Socceroos fixture than that. It's more huge than they think. It's, it's, gonna, it's gonna take over the country, isn't yeah, it? It's the yeah. and most big part in the world. Brazilians are going to embrace it? Everybody yeah. knows Brazil is the, the football's country. Yeah, so Brazil is top for a long time. I can't even imagine. Yeah. Because um, the whole world is coming here. Man, Australia, believe me, you don't want to miss this World Cup. How good is the World Cup going to be next year? It'll be fantastic, as we say. There are more Australians expected here than in any other World Cup before. 20,000 or more. Uh, the Green and Gold Army is really loud and fanatical. Just think, next year, these stands above you are going to be filled with the Green and Gold of the Socceroos. You don't want to miss out on that. I think there's probably no better place in the world to come for a World Cup than so what the Brazilians are like. Australians have any idea just how big it is? Yeah. No, not a chance. I'm 
recent World Cups, the 06 and 2010 World Cups that we had the support. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'll definitely go with the green gun now. And then, straight from the match, and hopefully a soccer's win, the Green and Gold Army will have you transferred back to the airport, where you'll have a flight awaiting to take you back to Green and Gold Army HQ in Copacabana, meaning more time experiencing Cidade Marvelosa, the marvelous city. Before you know it, you'll be back spending mornings on Copacabana, walking through the cobblestone streets of the downtown precinct, and exploring the captivating sights and sounds only Rio de Janeiro can provide. This is 2014 with the Green and Gold Army. This is Brazil. Okay, this has got to be one of my, be my favorite part of Rio de Janeiro. Every single neighborhood is different. Go through one area and it's influenced by colonial Portugal. Then the next will be a favela. After that, you've got this hip, cosmopolitan style uh, area that's got all the trendy kids running through it. Then you go to Copacabana and it's basically a little beach town. You know, everyone's got their swimwear on. So I've never seen such an eclectic mix of architecture, uh, people, buildings and, and culture. It's just phenomenal. Check that out. Boasting some of the most famous wonders in the world, the city of Rio de Janeiro is revered for its iconic landmarks. And after experiencing them yourself, you'll see why. Two nights based in the city, you've got the chance to discover more than just the touristic spots. Meaning, you'll explore the real Rio de Janeiro and the little wonders that make the city what it is. Because people here are crazy and I think when people come to the World Cup they are and they want to, to get crazy too yeah. and this this combined this combined welcome to Brazil <laughs> There will be nothing like the 2014 FIFA World Cup. And I implore everyone and anyone to get in on it. With the Rio Home Base package, the Green and Gold Army take care of all the hassles. All you do is sit back, enjoy Rio, all it has to offer in the football, and of course, the soccer is campaign through another FIFA World Cup. What more could you ask for? If you ever want to be part of a world event, if you ever want to travel to South America, next June 2014 is the time to be here. my Brazilian adventure wrapped up and just a snapshot of what you'll be experiencing in Brazil next year with the Green and Gold Army. With the Rio Home Base package, the Green and Gold Army take care of all your internal travels and accommodation. So you're going to be sitting back, relaxing and enjoying the best of Brazil, Rio de Janeiro and the World Cup. It's the 2014 FIFA World Cup, it's Brazil and it's the Green and Gold Army. It's the ultimate experience. Click below to kick it all off.